Welcome back to the channel everybody. We are going to continue on our Car Mechanic Simulator 2018 series and in today's episode we are going to do another game uh, mission and we will do one uh, customer car as well. Alright so let's go ahead and get started. Let's answer the phone see what is going on here. All right, all we have are customer cars. We do not have a um, mission to do, so we're just going to go ahead and grab this Katagiri Katsumoto X-Tech with some brake issues. Uh, let's go ahead and take that order. All right, and there we go. Let's see what they want from us. Uh, the ABS module is damaged, one ventilated disc, one caliper, and one brake disc. All right, let's go ahead and move it over to our lift. And put it up in the air. All right, let's go ahead and order a couple parts. Uh, we know that we need an ABS module. So let's go ahead and purchase one of those. And we also know that we need a ventilated disc and a regular brake disc. So let's go ahead and order that now. Let's go ahead and double check. Oh, and we also need a caliper. right there and if you remember from the la previous video we accidentally purchased a ventilated brake disc which we still have and so now we don't have to buy another one so let's go ahead and examine you'll notice that that caliper is damaged that ABS module up there is damaged and let's see here, Do we can we see anything else? Look at that, there's a disc, a ventilated disc in there is damaged, which means one of these rear and look, that one right there, that brake disc right there is damaged. So now we're, let's go ahead and take this off. Go ahead and remove this brake caliper. Remove that brake pad. Remove the brake disc. Put a good one on. Put everything. No. We'll put this one on. There we are. And there we go. Now let's do the same thing to the front end or the front wheel. Right, we have a bad caliper. And a bad ventilated disc. We'll put the good parts on. New brake pad. New caliper. We'll come around here so we can kind of see what we're doing. Put the front wheel back on and we'll, well, I attempted to tighten the lug nuts up in a star pattern like you're supposed to, but this is a video game, not real life. 
All right. And down here, we'll take this ABS module off. Put the new one on. All four things were fixed. Total payout of $1,417. Finish. And we are done. And you'll notice we also leveled up to level two. And we got a experience point. So let's go ahead and use that. So here at level two, we have one, uh, one available skill point. We can use it to do 50% fa faster part examination or 50% faster screwing and unscrewing. And let's go ahead and do that. That way we can get parts on and off a lot faster. Bam, done. Next level at 500 experience points, we will be able to choose one of these three. 50% discount, 10% faster walking, or 50% faster part installing and removing. All right, now let's go on and go back to our phone and see what we got here. We have some brake problems, brake system needs fixing, but now we also have our story mission available. So this is the part we're gonna do today. Uh, I read in the newspaper that the timing component should be replaced more frequently than recommended by the manufacturer. Same goes for the oil. Please check both of those things and replace whatever you decide is needed. All right, minimum parts condition of 100%. All right, we'll take this order. Now, in that description, it did say that we needed to do some timing parts. All right, so let's go ahead and we got a whole bunch of parts not discovered and we need to drain the old oil, put a new oil filter on it, and put new oil in it. Too easy. All right, move it over to car lift A. And there we go. All right, so first things first. Let's go ahead and drain the oil and we will put a new oil filter on if we can reach it from underneath. All right, oil is out of it. Let's go ahead and put it back. And look at that right there, an I-4 oil filter. All right, come over to the computer. We're going to look for an oil part, oil filter, I-4. And there is a new oil filter. All right. So you'll notice right here at the beginning that the four ignition coils are rusty, which means they will need to be uh, replaced. Can be examined by OBD scanner. Okay. So we're going to go into our examine tools, and, see, and we don't have any examine tools yet. Not a problem. Let's go ahead and take this ignition coil off. And you'll also notice that the spark plugs are kind of rusty. So we're gonna go ahead and take those out. All right, now, so we have four ignition coils, but we also have four other parts that need to be 
replaced, but we haven't discovered yet. So those spark plugs were not the issue. Okay, so let's go ahead and get back into the engine here. And let's see here. This is what we need to look at right here, this timing cover, because we are looking for the timing components. All right, so let's go ahead and start taking off these uh, pulleys and belts. And you'll notice that when you select a component, if there's something in the way, it will be red. Like here I am selecting this crankshaft pulley and that belt is highlighted in red. So we need to pull the belt off first. All right, so now we get some some rollers here. Take the water pump off. And now we can take our timing cover off. All right, so now we got two um, cams right there that need to come off. We'll take the timing belt off. Take these cam gears off, and you'll notice that those camshafts are rusty, so they'll need to be they will need to come off. But we need to take off the cover, the engine head cover first. All right, so let's take the camshafts out. And so now we have two camshafts, two cam gears, and four ignition coils. All right, so let's go and order some new parts. All right, so we need two cam gears. We need two camshafts. And we need four ignition coils. All right. Now let's go ahead and put parts back on. Put a new camshaft. A new camshaft. We're gonna go ahead and put the engine cover back on because that's all we need for this section. You know what, let's go ahead and put the spark plugs back in. All right, now we're gonna put new ignition coils in. And you know what, while we're here, uh, we can't do that quite yet. All right, we'll make sure that we do that before we uh, send it on its way. Put the new cam gears on. Put the timing belt back on. And the new, or the uh, timing cover. All right. Now we're gonna put on our rollers and pulleys. Put our water pump on as well. Our crankshaft pulling. And now we can put on our belt, a belt tensioner. Serpentine belt A, and that looks like it's going to be about it. There we go. Now we can put some oil back in it. There we are.
all eight parts are, are completed and we have changed the oil. Spent $910, bonuses, and a grand total payout of $2,200, and finish. There we go. And we also got a new level. We are now level three. So let's go spend our skill point. Level three, 50% faster moving part installing and removing, 10% faster walking, or 5% discount in shops. Um, let's go ahead and get this 5% discount. There we go. And now we are done with those two jobs. Let's go ahead and look at our parts. Let's go. Uh, we had a whole bunch of um, bad parts. Not too bad, though. Um, we're going to go ahead and we're going to sell this oil filter. We don't want to keep it used oil filter. So we're going to go ahead and sell all of our parts that are below 90%. And there goes all of our parts. And we do have a case for completing that mission. Let's go ahead and open up the case, see what kind of goodies we got. All right, we got a high quality exhaust manifold, a barn location, and a high quality air filter. Nice. All right. And these are high, high quality parts that we can use to uh, work on our own car. So we're going to go ahead and keep them. All right, guys, I think that's going to do it for today. Thank you all for stopping by. And as always, if you like what you see here, go ahead and like, comment, and subscribe down below. And thanks again for stopping by. I do appreciate it. Have a good one.